Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be vlogging our Saturday adventures. This morning I woke up early, I went to go get my nails done, and I got a mood changing color. So I guess when you're hot, it gets like bright red, and then when you're cold, it's dark maroon. I was like, oh, there you go. I'm like really in the Christmas vibe right now. Christmas, all, the, all that's going on, yeah. See the swing behind me? Lawson does not fit in his swing anymore. We have to put it away, which is very bittersweet, but now there's more room in my living room until he gets his bouncer for Christmas, then, then we're back to being cramped. Right now, I went to Fresh Market and I got some drumsticks because I am craving chicken wings. So what I like to do with my wings is put them in a Ziploc bag, so I've got like five of them in here now. This is my favorite seasoning. We got it when we went to Tennessee. It's Old Smoky Cajun Rub. I don't, oh, it tells you all the ingredients, what's in it, so I guess you can make your own. But just look up a Cajun Rub if you don't have this one. But it's like, I love spicy, and it is, it does have a kick to it, especially if you put a lot on. So what I'm gonna do is spray some olive oil, whoa, whoa, whoa. Spray some olive oil in there, and then dump some flour and then dump the seasoning in there and shake it really, really hard and then line them up on parchment paper, stick it in at 425 and I don't know how long, I'll keep an eye on it. You could skip the flour part if you wanted to. We actually got a new one. Some of our friends went to Tennessee and I was like, can you please pick us up some of this seasoning because we ran out, we used it all. And it is so good. Hey, naked boy. What you doing? What are you doing? Hey. <laughs> open the oven for me I probably put like too much seasoning on there cuz it's spicy but that's my go-to drink and if you have not tried the pistachio muffin from fresh market you're messing out it's so good you want to tell everybody what we're doing today you want to tell everybody what we're doing what are we doing we're gonna go get a Christmas tree! Yay! Mm -hmm. A really big one! <laughs> you can let the dogs out. Okay, I am back. It's only like an hour later. Um, I was not expecting Lawson to fall asleep. He was like getting really, really fussy, and so I was like, what is going on? So I just laid him down in the crib um, just to see if he would just take a little cat nap, and he's been asleep for um, probably 40 minutes now. So I was like, well, I have time, so I did my makeup. I'm wearing a brown turtleneck sweater that has little pockets right here, and then I'm gonna wear this with it and then I have a beanie hat that I'm gonna wear, and then I have my Just Fab um, rain slash snow boots that I got. It was in my shoe haul. If you haven't seen my shoe haul yet, go check that video out. I got a lot of really great stuff for cheap. I'm gonna eat my chicken wings, because I haven't eaten yet. Austin has already devoured his half of the wings and said they turned out really good. But I wanted to show you this eyeshadow palette really quick, because I got questions on it when I wore my pink. I don't wanna wake him up. When I wore my pink eye makeup look on my Instagram the day I got my makeup, my hair done, I wore a hot pink eye look. This Ace Beauty Grandiose Palette. I got it in my Boxy Charm this month. These are the beautiful colors. So I'm wearing cinnamon all over, and then I'm wearing Myrtle, which is a beautiful brown. I call it rusty shade. I'm wearing that in a lid, and then this hot pink color. 
and the poppy color. I wore both of those where I showed you guys that I got my hair done. I had hot pink eyes. Turned out really good and so I got a bunch of questions and I actually did like a little vote thing which I forgot that I did this. I asked my Instagram to vote if they wanted a tutorial on that eye look and a bunch of people said yes. Some people said no but a lot of people said yes so I need to do that. We're finally all loaded into the truck. We're getting some gas right now. Little man is working on a bottle. I'm trying to sit as still as I can. It's not working. Well, I want one that's going to be like as tall as our ceiling. I really would love to have this one. Like, I want a house big enough to have that. I can't wait for my house to smell this good. You smell the pine? You don't smell that? Nope. You get a really little, like, mini one for Lawson's room. Mm -hmm. Then we'd have to get another stand. Oh, I love that one. Is that too big? <laughs> a little bit. Do you see any trees you like? <laughs> Mommy forgot the stroller and the ergo. Yeah? Yeah, because it's going to have to be skinny because it's a small corner. I just, I was expecting these to be more full. You know what I mean? We're looking at the already cut down ones because the other ones are not thick like this. And this is what I want. This is like a balsam fur or something. Oh, well that's what I like. I, don't think I like this one. Yeah. That's a nice one. Yeah, I like that one. So we did not end up getting one of the trees at the farm because I didn't find one that I really liked. The, I guess it was like a six foot-ish one was $70 and it was very like, I, don't, I couldn't find one that was super full. The ones I found that were full were, I feel like very expensive, but I have I don't have experience like buying Christmas trees. I don't know what prices to expect. I don't know, I just don't know anything about it. I don't even know how to take care of one. So like this is a whole like learning process for me. So I like want to find one that I'm just like so in love with. And maybe that sounds weird because it's a Christmas tree, but I'm gonna look. We have so many different farms around here in my area for me to just like go look around. So I didn't want to just settle for the first one I saw. I want to continue to drive around and look at more farms. I didn't know that Austin had a surprise date planned. I don't know where we're going, but we just dropped off Lawson with my mom. We are stopped at a gas station right now, but we're headed to whatever surprise date this is. So I don't know if I will vlog it or not, but I will fill you in on whatever we do. I really hope we're going out to eat because I'm starving. <laughs> so 